This is a pre-release review from Lionel Ambassador of the Lionel American Flyer Two Bay Hoppers. What we'll look at today are uh, two of the four that are being offered. The first one is the Redding, and that is product number 644105 through 109, and the Great Northern 6 44095 through 099. Let's look at these uh, hoppers and see what improvements have been made. Comparing this to the previous two bay hoppers that were released by Lionel, if we look at the uh, trucks, let me see if I can get that a little bit of better view of that truck. Get in there. There we go. You'll notice in the old trucks, the side frames were uh, placed into the metal frame and they had um, fingers that came around the flange from the uh, metal frame and uh, fit into uh, for the truck itself. And the pins on the top of the frame were spread such as to hold the uh, truck in. On the new ones, if we look at the same uh, flange here, or uh, truck, um, it's a little hard to see, but you can see where the pins were. Now we have screws. So they've actually screwed the truck onto the uh, middle frame. See if I can get, get that a little bit better here. See if that'll focus in for me. There we go. It's a little hard to see on these uh, black frames. But um, in looking at it, no longer do we have the metal um, uh, tabs from the uh, side frame. And we actually have, uh, they're gone and the, fl and the uh, metal flange from the frame is there. But at the top of the um, trucks, you'll see they're actually screwed on now. So that should be for a better fit on the uh, side frames for the trucks and uh, an overall better product. Let's look at some of the features of these two bay hoppers. They have a simulated colo load on top both the Great Northern and the uh, Redding and we'll be going to the Redding shortly. Um, operating couplers, simulated side ladders, the um, uh, graphics uh, signs right here as well as the uh, lettering is nice and clear and crisp. Uh, the, the small lettering is uh, very good because it's still readable and the logos are very um, uh, pronounced and uh, clear. We look at the Redding and the same with the Redding the uh, uh, placards and the uh, graphics are uh, uh, quite readable even the um, diamond in the Redding um, logo here uh, you can read uh, Redding inside that uh, diamond so a very nice uh, car overall each of these cars we'll move out here a little bit each of these cars come in sets of five which each car being numbered differently and you'll see that on each of the numbers here once you uh, receive uh, cars the nice thing about it, you can buy a set of five and uh, definitely have a nice uh, coal consist. So uh, let's take a look at um, these cars on the layout and see how they track behind my uh, uh, Southern Pacific U-boat. Uh, Here we have our two new hoppers being pulled by a Southern Pacific U-33. Uh, and um, as part of a coal train coming in for a load.
as you can see both cars the Redding and the uh, Great Northern with its simulated coal load looks very nice uh, in front of um, for example the CBNO or the CNO uh, dump car and uh, as part of a coal train along with a um, uh, coal loader the cars track very well uh, very smooth no hiccups at all uh, definitely um, uh, nice looking and a well operating uh, two bay hopper when these uh, five number series hoppers start to get um, uh, released and shipped I think uh, you're going to enjoy them on your layout as far as making up a coal train whether you have a small layout like right now my 4x8 um, industrial loop here or you have a large uh, modular layout um, they certainly will look great in that uh, consist hope you enjoyed this uh, pre-production review of uh, Lionel American Flyer two-bay hoppers for Lionel Ambassador Program. Thank you.